guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's me carmen cute crafts and today's video is going to be an embellishment share video but before we hop into this video first off let me say hey girl hey to all my returning subbies hello and welcome to all my newbies thank you so much for hitting that subscribe button it means the world to me also don't forget to hit the bell notification so you can be notified every time i post a new video and of course don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like the content came up with these really cute shaker um, embellishments and I want to share them with you. Um, I'm going to share the ones that I made and then I'm going to add the tutorial on how to do it at the end of the video. So stay tuned if you want to see how to make these cute little Halloween shakers. Boop, boop. Okay, so these are my cute little shakers. Um, they're just really, really cute. So I'm going to just show you guys one at a time. So this one has orange and black flower on it, paper flower, some black trim, eyelash trim. So I did five with the orange and black. And they all have a little spider in the middle somewhere. Like there's there's the spider there. So really cute. I just think they're really, really cute. Oops. And here are the purple ones. I think these are so cute. They're super easy okay, to So make. for supplies, you're going to need a circle punch. I have two and a half inches. <clears throat> you're gonna need these small ornaments. You're going to need some paper flowers of your choice. I'm going to do two purple and a black, so you just need three. Um, and then you need some spiders, these plastic spiders. You're going to need some trim and then some sequins and glitter of your choice. Okay, so I already punched out the pattern paper that I want. I did spider webs. I'm going to take some tweezers and get my little plastic spider here. And all I did was take some hot glue on the legs. And then just stick it somewhere on the paper. And then while that's drying, I didn't want to wait for it to dry. So I took some glitter of my choice, which I chose purple glitter for this one. And I'm just gonna take my little spoon and I just douse the spider in purple glitter so that that adheres to the hot glue. Okay, so now that we've got the purple glitter on there, I'm going to go ahead and take some of this black glitter that I got from Target a while ago and just add a lot of that in there. I was going to say some, but put a lot. And then I'm going to grab some of this really pretty um, white sequins and add that in there. And then I'm trying to keep everything towards the middle so that when I put the dome on, it's um, not in the way of the dome. Okay, and then I'm just gonna add some purple sequins that I got from Tuesday morning. So all I'm gonna do is place hot glue around the edge. I burnt myself the first time. 
So I'm hoping the second time. Is the charm and then I'm just gonna try to get it where it's around all of the sequins like that and then I'm gonna take our black eyelash trim and I'm just gonna stick a glob of glue um, on the side there and I'm gonna take one of these paper flowers. I'm gonna take the purple one and I'm just gonna stick that on there so that it pins the trim down. And then let me get my hot glue finger. Then I'm just going to go around the globe again with a generous amount of hot glue and just pin the trim down and just go back and snatch out the trim so that it's not all getting hot glued down and then I'm going again and just taking the trim pulling some off uh, just so that it's all fuzzy around. And then right here, I'm gonna just add some dollops of hot glue. And I'm gonna put the black flower in the middle and then another purple flower on the other edge. And there you have it, your cute little shaker glue.